what's your name, buddy? Are you here to buy some medicine? Where are your mom and dad? Are you... No, I'm not. Um... Hey there, Chi-Chi. Hi, Gray. What's going on? Hi, Trap. Ah, uh, you've actually come at the perfect time. This little boy seems to have gotten himself lost. No, listen to me. Your dad? Well, my dad... So... She went out a few days ago. I remembered that the owner of Boo Boo Farm is... When we got to the city gate, I took a moment to ask the Millith guards for directions to the... I asked the Millith... You came to the right place. We're pros at... Changsheng can... Hey, who's talking about me back... Changsheng, hello, child. You have a talking snake? Oh, are you Uncle Baiju? <laughs> Changsheng, now's... My dear boy, could you tell me more about... Yes, Uncle... I see. And your family lives near Chingsa Village, you... Uh-huh. Hmm. I you? Whoa! I certainly do. I use parents... Don't forget us, too! We already told I... Oh, really? Well, that's... Chi-Chi and I need... Family... Thank you. Traveler? Paimon? Why don't you come... They search to the north. <sighs> well, that. Excuse me, sirs. Have you found out any? Ah, uh, hey there, buddy. The boy at. Oh, thank good. As for up, the guards at the Luhua Pool. The terrain there can be tricky to navigate. Let's hope he hasn't run into any trouble. You will. Oh. Sorry, we weren't able. That's okay. <laughs> It is the sweet besides. Now you're <sighs> me. Oh, really? I thought I was persona non grata at Boo Boo Far. Okay, deal. We're not gonna. I'm happy to do it. You must be pleased you brought the. Tr well, time is. Blockages, I see. Dr. Baiju? Don't you worry. Ayu, do you know what? Um... Hmm, so it's been a lot. No. Come and see me at... Thank you, Dr. Baiju. If you still... However... Yes, of course I'll... See you tomorrow. <sighs> Bye for... Are you ready, Ba... You 
know? Paimon's... yeah! Idling time on admiring the scenery, the spectacled snake bedecked. Hello, you busy bees. And actually, uh, oh, and huh? I thought I told. <laughs> well, it is a dusty old tale by the these days. Okay. Almost. Wow. According that farmer, my grandpa. So my grand funeral. If he had just. But according, hand on top. In well, don't know. But one thing I do know about Baiju, anyway. So. I will be sticking around here. <sighs> After all that, it seems like we have more questions than answers. <laughs> It's a new day! Let's go back to Boo Boo Pharmacy and check out how Jialian is doing. Dad! Uh, huh? Oh. Dad! You... Yes? Don't worry, Dad. I got the Adventurer's Guild to help us look for her. And Dr. Baiju's gonna help too. Great. That's wonderful. I can't thank you enough, Dr. Bai. My pleasure. <laughs> Not at all. You're still in the early st- I suggest you- Director Who? Do you have any- mm, It seems like- But- uh, How did you accomplish- <laughs> Though I regret- Oh, come on. <sighs> ah. Yeah, I've been- Ah, yes, of course. Everyone? <coughs> Suffering now, are <sighs> But in any case, why must you keep this as- Who's there? <coughs> why did you follow us here? Oh. <laughs> what did I just- Traveler, Paimon. Instead, he transferred- <sighs> Baiju. My pre- I believe the irregular- the poison- Changsheng? Hey! I'll have- I was treating pi- Whoa. Please, that's enough. Wait a sec. Hardly. Still. Traveler. Paimon. Uh. Baiju. Thank you. Huh. Paimon doesn't- The poison in Jialiang sist- Yes. Let's head there together. As well as in- Let's go find some treasure. Ah. Oh, that reminds Paimon. She was indeed. She is several. Sup Wait. Jiang Li, the last time she visited. Quarrel? I don't know. Nor did Ma. Oh. No. <sighs> Paimon never knew. <laughs> so. What? <laughs> Let's split. Come quick! 
Chung Shung and I found a hidden com. Hmm. Uh. No. Your eyes do. Some talks. If it's a con. Offshoots? Correct. Whoever is administering the poison. The call of the. Only one. Uh, this is getting crazy. <clears throat> hey, since the. You mean. Think a little. Huh? So you're saying. <gasps> it, wait, but. I agree. Look at the. F hmm. It's too early to. Yes. So if we. Do you know anything about God Hmm. <sighs> well. Chung Sheng's memory. These days. She ha- Whoa. What? Hey, plenty of- With my assist- Stronger and healthy? Uh- Unfortunate. Temper. Ugh. This is ex- All right, everybody, calm down. Back to the- <laughs> With how- What? <laughs> oh. If you're talking about who Paimon thinks you're talking about, you better do the- You called? Ah! Uh, uh. Well, huh? Baiju of the Lantern Rite. Huh? You Our paths have crossed. I sense the presence of evil spirits. Is this why you called me? <sighs> Too often, I now know what a vile mo- The land was- The seal is- However, it's I do not like but when demonic forces are involved. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I do not wish immortal I shall trust farewell. What a strange adeptus. That's you! If the god rem <sighs> Ma Master Master Gray? Did you run all the way from Boo Boo Pharmacy? What happened? It's it's Jiao Yang. Uh, he was he was already? Based on pe it everyone. Back to boot. How is he doing? Dr. Baiju, you're back! Lingway left. Kue, please? Yes, of course. Don't worry, I. Baiju's not gonna use Chung Sheng's secret art again, is he? <laughs> Feeling, Dad? Are you? Ah. Hmm. Master said he needed to take a quick rest and asked me to bring you out of the treatment room. He hasn't emerged yet, so he must still be resting. Oh. Re ah. Hmm. No. I'll come with. Don't forget. <clears throat> no. Traveler, Baiju hasn't shown his. F huh? You're finally- There was no time. I had no other choice. Jiang Li's design is quite brilliant. So, they've been outside. behind our backs again. Ah! Baiju! Chang <sighs> Jiaoyang seems- I... and as a- What? Yes. 
Jia Liang, though it was... Had he not taken it all these... Still, more... That explains... God remains are extremely dangerous to be around. Because humans have known... I fear that the situation... I never sus... To sacrifice one's own life to save others. To go be... Well, I think in any case, her regular... Ex and given that she's already been missing for several days... It's me, Traveler, Dr. Baiju. Uh, it's Dr. Baiju, you've already done... After all, if it wasn't for me, I'm sure I'll be... A be careful. No, before I forget it... This trip will be... <laughs> There's only one thing I fear now. Very well. Dr. Baiju, are you heading out again? Yes. Please add an extra measure of mist grass pollen. Uh, Hop to it now. Okay. Just like the day I went missing. The mother lode's influence is growing strong. Jia Liang, can you sense which direction? I think it's this way. Yes, I'm sure of it. I feel a dull ache in my heart. <sighs> This must be the way. This place feels familiar. I think I've been here before. Hmm. There is an... I think I remember this place. Jia Liang, are you... No. I... <sighs> There's still a long road ahead. As you wish. A pleasure to be working with you. Marks here. A thieves' tunnel? Hmm. Judging by the two, but why did they abandon? Ah, I remember. But she, uh, she said that the easy job.
Whoa, there's a sensor here. Those treasure hoarders should... I believe this sensor was used to burn a monster repel... A monster repelling incense? The incense was burned several... No doubt an encounter after them. That's right. This... Jelly up! I'm fine. Let's keep going. Adventure time! We're getting close. We're almost there. It's right up ahead. The place where we made a pact together to... Uh... <sighs> Aha! We can keep going now! From the looks of it, the energy released by this mechanism can not only clear barriers, but also be conducted by corresponding mechanisms. Perhaps it's something we can make use of. Mind the side effects. Cough, a bitter pill to swallow. Remember, health comes first. Leave it all to me. Let's light it up. Whirling snow. That's gonna hurt in the morning. Let's light it up! The doctor was seeing. Mind the side effects. My apologies.
Uh, Look out! Uh, there's a monster next to her! The god remains must have lured them here. Watch my back. Whirling snow! Steady as stone. Time to clean up. Bitter pill to swallow. Propagate! Taking a turn for the better. The doctor was seen. Leave it all to me. Scatter! Take flight! So! Mind the side effects. The doctor was seen. Dr. Baiju, how serious is it? I can still feel a pulse, but her condition is... The god remains here are encroaching on her. If we don't eliminate it... Then what are we waiting for? It's not if the poison within if the source is uh, Oh no. Indeed. <sighs> I wondered when the stain Wait, wait, wait! Baiju You could It appears to me that she was striving to concoct your medicine for Dr. Baiju, give it to me. The god remains have reached her internal organ. But Dr. Baiju, if I continue to sustain my I know for a f if my choice can bring you <sighs> of course. Thank you, everyone. And I'm sorry. I am sure that over the years... Mortal Surf, what a crazy situation. Jiang Li risked it all to save Jia Liang's life. And... I've seen many... In the human realm, at least... The path they chose was indeed a heroic one. But when I think of those who... I cannot help but think... When all this began... <laughs> if you could only see him now. He took me all the way to Liyue Harbor. To see the doctor. And he even got the adventurer's guild to search for you. <laughs> so, I know... <clears throat> I've said my goodbyes. As you wish. It will eat away at both. I'll take. Why would these memories come to mind now? <sighs> the longer we live... Oh, how I would love... Dear... Straight. Dr. Baishu. <laughs> I'm uh... That's right. Of course, this whether it will keep but however long you have left, I believe it should be more than sufficient time for you to say your final goodbyes. An elixir of immortality? How'd you cook that up? Ugh. It's a work in progress that hardly lives up to its name. And it would have had no if in the end, all I know is that if I and even this would have counted. Oops! Without Director Who nudging things in the right direction. No wonder he didn't. <clears throat> <laughs> Dire. <laughs> oh, 
All I wanted, leave it to Boo Boo. <sighs> One Chi Chi was. You stay away from my dad! <sighs> oh, is that right? Traveler, Paimon, I'll catch you up. <sighs> All swell that ends well. <laughs> <A tongue. laughs> it feels like it was a whole. Yay, Paimon! All right. Wait up! I'll come to. Baiju. Don't mention it, J. Just your duty, huh? Now that. Uh. First. Uh. Hmm. Time flies. It's been so long since we bade each other farewell in Chen Yu Vale. Changsheng, you're the same as ever. You haven't changed one bit. You, on the other hand, have changed a lot. You're right. My younger self would have never imagined that things would one day turn out this way. Or that you'd turn out this way, Baizhou. I've taken a look at your elixir of Im I have to say, Jiangli, it was a stroke of j No, not at all. But I'm not just Baiju. Huh. Life force- Nothing gets past you, Jiangli. You are correct. When I treat it, there is no need to worry about any long-term consequence- But you took s <sighs> The reason I left our master, but in the end, are all disciples of Chen Yu- We are doc- Baiju. I can- Can you- Still stop before it's too I think you know the end. Hey, food's ready! Mom, come and join us! The traveler to- <sighs> Yes, darling. Mom will be there in just a second. Baiju, Chi-Chi. There's no need- <sighs> Hmm. Baiju, what did Jiang Li mean by- Every single mortal- Wait! <sighs> Long ago, when plagues ravaged the land, one doctor made a pledge to rid the world of pain and suffering. But even the most ingenious mortal medicine could not stay the tide of disease. And after working tirelessly for many years, even his dearest loved ones fell sick and bade their final farewell. Legends told of an herb lord in Chen Yu Vale who could cure any illness known to mankind. The doctor sought the herb lord, but found only a white snake, its breathing weak and its power all but spent. Sign this contract and let our lives be joined. Then I will impart to you the secret art of healing. But be warned, this art will harm your own health. With means beyond human ken, the doctor could now reverse the process of death. And yet, the time still came to say goodbye. Only now, the one departing was the doctor, his life force spent. His final act in life was to pass on the contract to his final patient, his favorite disciple. The disciple chose to dedicate their life to saving the lives of others. And generation upon generation followed in these footsteps. <coughs> Since I inherited this contract, 
I've always respected the path taken by my predecessors, and followed it myself unquestioningly. That is, until I tried to use the art to save my own disciples, beloved. She begged me not to use up my own life force. She said that this art is a poison chalice, an evil and unnatural practice. She did not wish to sacrifice one life for the sake of another, when both were lives she treasured. Only then did it occur to me. Did I not suffer when my master passed away, just as patients' families do at their loved one's deathbed? Are not the lives cut short by this contract just as worthy of saving as any patients? What is this contract to us? Medicine or poison? Alas, I no longer have enough time left to find the answer. I entrust to your care both Chang Sheng and this final question. May you find a remedy for this conundrum, which has ailed us so. Time and again, no matter how much I try to warn them or balance their chi, I can never save them. And you? What's your answer? If I abandoned the contract and left you without a host, what would happen? Hmm. I suppose I'd spend my final moments taking a nice nap on Mount Yaojin. Then I'd be reunited with my old friends and your predecessors. Then it's decided. If there's a life in front of me that deserves to be saved, why shouldn't I do everything within my power to save it? <sighs> Once again, it's the same answer. So be it. Close your eyes. Who knows how many more people will take on this contract? None. This contract will end with me. My contract has strict requirements on the host's natural temperament. All my hosts have been most pure of heart. But when one with an altruistic nature gains access to this art, they are more seduced than the average person by the miracle of overturning the laws of life and death. Though they know better than anyone else the fate that awaits them, when faced with the sorrows of humanity and the pain of losing their nearest and dearest, they cannot help but reach beyond human means. They are like moths that throw themselves into the flame, seeking a- So? <laughs> I suppose that would make me a moth that yearns for the light, but doesn't want to be burned to a crisp. Chengsheng's are- I have nothing but the utmost respect- Huh? But- didn't you- What makes a poison, poison? And what may- If disease is def- Many may view the notion of searching for immortality in poisons and illnesses as a flagrant violation of the natural order. I don't want those who come after me to- Precisely. Even the gods of old- Hmm. For a selfish moth like me- Huh. For once? Dr. Baiju, Traveler! What are you still chatting about? The food's about to get cold! We also have coconut milk for Changsheng and Paimon. Um, okay, fine. Let's go grab some food. Paimon has a bunch of burning questions, but... <sighs> I do envy Paimon sometimes. <laughs> True. And yet, are such things... 